Hi there, and welcome to Neophyte.tv, the technology show for the not-so-geeky. My name is Tiffany Young. And I'm Ben Friedman, and we're looking at uh, a couple of different products today. And the uh, first thing we're going to look at is a pair of wireless headphones uh -huh. by a company called Etimotic. Etimotic? Etimotic? Etimotic. These are the Eti 8s. And here's how it works. So, okay. got your iPod. Uh -huh. And it comes with this little iPod dongle. Okay. You love your dongles. Oh. Mm -hmm. Like so. Okay? <laughs> okay. And then you uh, go on here and you play some music on here. Ba -ba -ba -bum. We'll just throw something on here. And uh, okay. So and then you turn these on okay. with the little button on the side here. I, I don't know if we'll be able to see it, but there's a little tiny little play, fast forward, rewind, and a little power button up here. Okay. And you play down there. And now, crank the volume up. These are your Bluetooth headphones. Now go ahead and put these in your ear. In my ear? Yeah. Okay. Let's see. <laughs> what do you think? What? They do a really good job of canceling out the, uh, the noise. And I got to tell you, these headphones sound fantastic. And the sound quality you get from them is very, very cool. Let me show you what you look like. Um, <laughs> oh dear, oh dear. Hold on, I'm getting a message from the Klingons. <laughs> Captain Kirk, Klingons are on hailing frequency. <laughs> that, um, they don't stay in my ears. And the sound quality is good. Yeah, but you've got to get, you got to, there are little... Uh, and they're heavy on the back end, so yeah. it's like, you know, they don't... They, they, there really, is a wire between them, but there's no wire to your iPod. The, uh, and the uh, style is just not going to work. You don't like these? The style, the, you You could know. not just, okay, stick one in your ear. It's, it's just not, it's not going to be functional or... Okay, now turn a bit towards the, uh, towards here. It's bigger than my ear. <laughs> you think it's too big? I love these headphones. I think they yeah, sound fantastic. Not, it sounds good, but not only is it like it sticks way out of your ear on top of it, you know. So it's like so this for is you, a, the fashion is not going to work. This for is it. absolutely well. It's not. It's fashion and functionality because I, when I put this in my ear, well, there's a smaller tip you can put on it. But it's, it's still it's still it's heavy. heavy. Yeah, heavy on the back end. Yeah. So you know, no. I mean, I, there's no way I could even run with these. I mean, they would, they would fall out. I think you're right. I think jogging or any sort of uh, you know uh, fast moving exercise. Um, good for airplane though. Very good for yeah. airplane because they block out a lot of the noise sound. cancellation. And with you know what? On my style. laptop, which has Bluetooth, um, you don't even need the dongle. Right. Now that's the, the only way to that's connect nice to these. The only way is via Bluetooth. Okay. So if your laptop doesn't have Bluetooth, or if you have a non, you know, have a non iPod, there's no mm -hmm. way to, to, to hook that up. But here, the iPod blues in. It, you can stick this in your pocket. Uh -huh. And if you want, you know, if somebody says uh, you're walking down the street and somebody says hi, you just have to click the, the play button, and it stops. Try that. Go I should ahead. really put it back in my ear. Yeah, put it back in your ear again. Now click that little play right. button. Okay. Isn't that cool? I think it's fantastic. It's, you know, you've got to be careful not to pierce your brain by pushing too hard. <laughs> which I found so in the first my brain week or so. Like, yeah. Um, <laughs> <laughs> it came out wrong. But it's cool. You've got a... Uh, <laughs> <laughs> You've got a little volume up and down. I, I appreciate you not following up with that. I'm just not going to go there anymore with that. Uh, you got a little volume up and down, a little fast forward rewind on here. Okay. And so on, on, yeah, on the airplane, now this doesn't work with Macs. only works with PCs because the Macs don't have that uh, Bluetooth profile for this yet. Okay. But the, the PCs... What is that, up with that? They're like really slacking. Uh, Macs are always seem to be just a little bit behind on that kind of stuff. They, pick up, they try to make up for it in beauty. That's right. There's an analogy to be made there. I'm not going to go with it. Not even going to touch it. So these are the Etymotic 8s. I think these are um, very cool. A little pricey. A little pricey. What do you think those would go for? Again, these, these are high quality uh, headphones. They are high quality as far as the sound. They are high quality. I really also really like the design as far as from here to here. Yeah. I think that's nice. This is the and little, they look the beautiful. The little boxes are the what totally throws me off. Right. Um, Price-wise, well, I know... That you know the Plantronics and some of the other ones are going for around the two fifty. So I'm probably going to say in the two two range. Yeah, three, three hundred bucks. And yeah. keep wow. in mind, this is not you can't. These aren't for your cell phone. There's no microphone. Yeah, it's not for hands free. That's true. It's just for playback. 
Um, you charge these by plugging in this, this tiny little port on here. Has, it comes with this custom USB cable. Oh, that's cable. the cutest little USB yeah. cable I've ever seen. But it seen. only charges with USB. There's no other charger included. So you can't plug it into the wall. Yeah. You have to plug it into a computer. Ah. Or you can get one of those USB to the wall adapters. That's crazy. Mm -hmm. It didn't come with other adapters? No, but you can't, you know, you can get those ones that, that plug into the wall that convert to a USB. Yeah, but, you know, for but 300 bucks, it should come with a whole kit. Come with a, yeah, it should come, it should like come. the Plantronics, for example, that's the Plantronics it's one, still, yeah. a, you know, a little bit bulky and big, but it, you know, it comes with all the stuff, so. Right, yes. You're so right. that is the Eti 8 from uh, Eti Modic, and I got to tell you, sound quality wise, um, Fantastic. Yes, and you, I agree. You know, with Bluetooth, a lot of people say Bluetooth doesn't have the sound quality. I think these sound great, and they isolate really well. For the noise-canceling purposes, yeah. I mean, I would prefer this. There's These have the Bose noise-canceling. Those are like 300 bucks. Yeah. You know what I mean? I like these So for, for travel and, you know, not hearing when, you know, definitely. Right. I, now, I would prefer that over another noise-canceling headset, Now I got this, not for I got this one use. just for you. Staying in oh, the Bluetooth sweet, realm yeah. here. Yes, this is, uh, this is from a company called RadTech. And this is the Blue Take uh, Bluetooth headset for your cell phone. That's so cute. Look, Look how at tiny that. that puffy is. This is for your cell phone? Yes, yeah, for your cell phone. Now stick that in your ear. <laughs> it's like put that in your pipe and smoke it, right? Yeah, put that in your ear. Tell me what do you think about well, that weight wise. And turn to the camera so we can all see you. There it is, yeah. What? Do you what? No, you've got your other <laughs> ear. Don't give me that. But this one's a lot smaller and a little lighter. And what do you think of that weight? I really wise? like it. You like yeah. that? And it fits in my ear. It does fit in your ear. It's going to stay in there. I think it's pink, so it's definitely kind of got that for the ladies yes, uh, look. Try your other ear. Try my other ear. Well, just because it's okay. the one facing the camera. I think his ear's smaller. Is that weird? Are your ears different sizes? Everybody's ears are different sizes. Is that a fact? I had no clue. But I didn't realize how much. Okay, so yeah, that goes. There you go. Yeah. So that looks, you can't, don't look. Oh, yeah, you can see it right there. Yeah. What do you think? I, like I think it. the pink makes that look acceptable. Looks almost like a, a hairpiece, huh? Yeah, like a barrette. You yeah, mean? like yeah. a barrette. Yeah. yeah. Now, it, it's tiny. Would you agree? Yes. Absolutely tiny. The sacrifice that you make by the fact that it's tiny is in battery life. Oh. So this okay. thing does not have the longest battery life. It only has a couple of hours. Very cute. Okay. But here's what they've done. And I don't know if you're going to like this or not like it. How about sound quality? Sound quality is, is good. Good okay. audio, good. But let me ask you about this. So here's the charger. Okay. You plug this into the wall. And when you want to charge this, you stick this in the charger, right? Okay. Uh -huh. Very good. However, there is a second battery in the charger itself. This is the cool okay. part. Okay. So their idea is this. You, you actually like wear this, like jewelry, I guess. You wear this around your neck. Okay. All right. Give it a shot here. Yeah, it's got the lanyard. Okay. okay. Like, just like jewelry. And when, you want, if, if you're, when this runs out of battery, you plug this in here like so. Is it turned speakerphone? No. Oh. But it now charges it up from its own battery. Oh, I see. See the little blue light that's I on do. there? I do. So it's in this little docking station, even yeah. while it's unplugged. So it's like a second battery right. to charge itself back up again. Well, how long does one battery last? Well, so they don't actually say on the website, but it's uh. like, I found it was a couple of hours. Okay. And then you get a couple more hours on this, which brings it more in line with the other headsets that are bigger. Right. But it means you have to carry that around. Interesting. What do you think? Could you live with that? Would you keep this in your car and, and plug it in? Or? I'd probably keep it in my handbag. Yeah? If I, yeah, if I found that I was using this. And then when it runs out of batteries, you can just plug it into the charger. Yeah, pop and then it in there. It, yeah, pop it in there. And then when you're done, you have to plug them both in. You know, you plug, plug this in to charge both batteries. To get this out, there's a little switch right on the front here. Did you lift that? So uh, the only thing that I'm, and you've used this for the sound quality. So, yeah, I'm, I'm and I people can it, hear you. you know, I'm, I can't put a pink thing in my ear. People can hear you well and... Yeah. 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 Well, you know, it's, it's usual. It's the same sort of thing with a lot of them that don't have a boom. So the people, right. people are saying, you sound a bit far away, you sound a little bit distant. Because that's the number one thing. These are so useless if you do not have something that people can hear you on. Yeah. Unless you're just listening to voicemail. I, I found it pretty good, uh, but you get that same sort of distant -y sound that you get with a lot of headsets. Right. But not, no worse than cute. other ones. Yeah, no, it's, it's cute. I mean, if it, if it does what it, you know, it says it's going to do and right. people can hear you. So that was the uh, Etymonic Eddie 8 Bluetooth uh, headphones, and this is from RadTech. It's the Bluetake uh, USB headset for your cell phone with two batteries, one in the headset yeah. and one in the little charger. Neat design. Yeah. It just means you have to take the little charging thing with you, and uh, again, you can wear it, dangle it you know, as jewelry. See, what I think yeah. is uh, 
my cell phone. Yeah. <laughs> when I'm when I or would you like maybe want this as a keychain? What I would use. Well, yeah. What I would use it for too is I would use this little. I need to get one of these with just the adapter. Right. Cell phone, like when you're talking on speakerphone, have that around your neck and. As long as it's not too heavy. Is that really no? Dangle about your tray or your cue or whatever. Yeah, it is. right yeah. here. See, right, right there. Right here. Yeah. So you put it right there. So when you have your speaker up this way, so you hang it this direction. You know, you know what I mean. They should have a little thing right here, so that way when you're talking, you're trying to, you can hear. There People you can go. hear you. I think it's a good idea. Anyway, just a thought. And we will be right back in just a moment. <laughs> Stay tuned. Hey, I'm Andy Walker. You just bought a new computer with Windows Vista on it, or maybe you've got an old XP computer that you upgraded. Well, we've just created an amazing new DVD. It'll teach you everything you need to know about the new operating system from Microsoft. It's called Getting Started with Windows Vista. In this DVD, there are three sections. One is out of the box. What do you need to do as soon as you start up Vista? Number two is Vista Essentials, things you need to know every day to make your computer experience amazing. Antivirus, security, all kinds of new features that Vista offers. And finally, geek tips and tricks, things you need to know that nobody else will have told you to make you a Vista guru. For more information, check out our website at gettingstartedvideo.com. And welcome back to Neophyte.tv. In the second spotlight section today, how much money do you think you spend on bottled water every year? A year? Every year. What do you think you spend on bottled water? I probably spend 50 bucks a month on bottled water. 50 bucks a month? I'm a Fiji fan. Fiji, uh, water? Fiji water? Yes. Fiji water fan. That's not cheap. No. That is expensive. More expensive than gasoline. And you will not drink tap water. You don't like tap water. Well, I, in Alaska, where I was, I'm from, we drink tap water always, and the water is good. Because it's like from the mountains. Yeah, it's like real good water. And, and I came here. It's from Russia. It comes over the Bering Strait. Is that right? I don't know. Uh-huh. making this up. Sounds good. Anyway, so uh, I came here, turned on the faucet, yeah. you know, 10 years ago, and I was like, it was warm, like... Well, here in the desert, the water quality is not that great coming oh. out of the tap. I mean, it's chlorine-y, and, you know, water comes... It's up, not... You know, it, it comes from a, a distance. Yes, it was right. very. It was a very sad water quality. So this is a uh, water treatment system by Lotus. Lotus okay. Water Treatment System is, is the name of it. Actually, the company name is Tursano. So you're going to save me a Tursano. lot of money. Big bucks. Big bucks, with this okay. Guy. And uh, a lot of water treatment is just filter. There's just a filter and, you know, it's supposed to do that. But this goes one step further. Yeah. What this actually does is it uh, uses um, some technology. I think it ozonates. Ozonates? Is it like reverse osmosis? No, it's uh, ozonation to... Oxidation? <laughs> to actually filter out <laughs> the uh, yeah. bacteria and any harmful stuff in the water. Like, Here's oh. the way it works. And you've got, this is your, your uh, primary water tank. Okay. Get that off, and you fill this with water from your tap. And by the way, this will work. They say it'll work on well water. I mean, you don't. It's not. You don't even need tap water. It'll kill stuff in well water. You could probably use like lake water. Or uh, are you serious? Yeah, I haven't lake actually. Water? I haven't actually tried peeing in here and seeing what oh comes out. Oh my gosh! I think that we should just grab some Sororo Lake water and then have you try it and yeah. see how it works out. Uh, it comes with a, the first little thing is this little filter on top. But let me tell you. If you've got to use a filter like that to clean your water, it's probably not the best water supply to be drinking from. And well, what does that actually strain out of there? <laughs> That's my point. You know, so <laughs> all of the uh, like uh, okay. bugs that are in your water. Right. <laughs> anyway, so I don't know. That's for I guess if you're on a well. So system. that means you don't have to chew up your water. That's right. Right. Okay. You put this on. You lock it in, and then go ahead and press that big button in the front. And you notice what is happening here is apparently it ozonates some air. It could just be blowing bubbles for all I know. But what they say is it like <laughs> ozonates the air, filters that through the water, and okay. that kills all the nasty yeast and the bacteria. Does it taste better? Well, that is what we're going to uh, decide today. Then, it, this is a little cycle. This lasts six minutes. So we now have to talk for six minutes while we're waiting for this to do. Oh, my gosh. Yes. So, that's, so what are we going to talk about? So once it's done here, it goes into this filter. There's a filter inside here. Okay. And then it comes out this little spout here. And they, it comes with this nice plastic jug. Mm hmm which has a really cool little flappy thing on the top. I don't know if you can see this. So when the it, you don't have to take the lid off to pour. Oh, I see. Yeah. When you pour this, the water lifts this little flap up. Okay. So this is the idea is to keep this in your fridge so you have nice chilled water. You'll notice over here there's a button. And, and at the end of its cycle, if this is resting against that button, it will actually dump into there. So you see how it sits oh, against that button? I do. Now the water... Reminds me of the juicer. Of a juicer? Yeah. Well, you know, right, the, the juicer, yeah. Same sort of design. Okay. Now we have to chat for uh, about four or five more minutes while we are waiting for this uh, system to uh, get. What do you Price. want to talk about? Price? $149. 
for this system, which again, with the cartridge system and all that stuff, so three months worth of Fiji water for you. Well, it depends on how it tastes. Yes. I, I, I'd be hair, very hard pressed to I understand. get a good... Now, I, I'm going to get you to taste this when it comes out, but keep in mind, okay. it's not cold, it's just still room temperature. Hey, that's fine. I can, yeah. Actually, I don't, I don't know how well I can even taste. It's so cold thing. Well, we'll both taste it. We'll, right, we'll, we'll see if you can tell the difference between the tap water and this filtered water. Okay, well, hopefully I can, because I'd like to save $50 a month. So, this is a six-minute cycle for tap water. Okay. And, by the way, I don't know, can you guys hear that? Let me hold my like mic a, a little closer. You think it'd be like a 45-minute for lake water? You hear or, that in your vibration? case, like two hours for urine. <laughs> you said it. <laughs> so, is there a different cycle for, like, Yes, you know? there's a different cycle. You switch it to a different cycle for lake water, or not lake water, but well water. Well water. I don't know if it does. I'm, I don't want to get uh, Tersano or the Lotus Folk in, in trouble here. I don't know that it does lake water. Oh, disclaimer. Yes. So you can't take it camping. Does it I work on batteries? If you like yeah. put, put Jello in there, for instance, or <laughs> you know, super glue. I, I don't know. I don't know, but you know, I bet some kids could find out. Well, and you know what? My kids love this. So I turn uh, this on. They're like, ooh, bubbles, bubbles, right. bubbles, bubbles. So they watch this for about an hour, and it allows oh. my wife and I to actually watch some television. Goldfish. So, yeah. Fish tank. Kind of looks like a fish tank. Huh? We well, got about three minutes left. So what's new in your life, Tiff? Oh, let's see. I've been staying really busy. Um, I was four. I was four. Yeah, his name was uh, Cheyenne. Is it really is true that you never forget? Maybe I, I was Cheyenne five. Cheyenne was a woman's name. I, he was a boy. Yeah, he was. Well, maybe not. Maybe, maybe I kissed a girl. A yeah, maybe I kissed a girl for the first time. Anyway, so yeah, Keep I remember. Keep those comments coming. <laughs> <laughs> we were talking about your first child experience. Yes. Yeah, I, I was four, and it was. I, I totally remember it. It was. Yeah. It was just a little kid kiss, but well, I remember that. I remember the first time yeah. I played doctor. Tell us about it, Tiff. No, I actually, yeah. The mirror is getting it warm was... in here. <laughs> How many more minutes do we have? <laughs> Probably about two, I would guess. Uh, it seems to be going very slowly. Okay, what's the number one favorite thing that you like to do? And we probably got about a minute or so left to go. I may cut some of this out because it's kind of boring. Yeah. Uh, let's see what else. Um, how about... Uh... I also think that the top of this would make uh, a nice uh, sailor cap. <laughs> Let's see if I can get that the balance. I was trying to do a little Popeye. Good. Yuck, 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 yuck. <laughs> All right, it doesn't make a very good cap. I thought it would. I thought oh, it would Oh, gosh. Oh, look at the time. Oh. <laughs> Don't blow your nose. You got another two minutes to, for this to finish, okay. and then, then you can blow your nose. What am I? A bird. <laughs> It's done. You'll know when it's done. Oh, it tells you. <laughs> ah! Oh, whoa. Hello. Wow. No, no, no. Okay, you gotta push, put that. There we go. Yeah, there we go. Yeah. So, now we're done, the phase. And this is all automatic as long as the thing is right where it should be. Okay. Which it wasn't quite there. But now, as you can see, and it's, it's you know, the, the bubbly side is going down, and the purified water is coming out of this area. Over here. It's going to be some really good tasting water, yes, you think? Yes, okay. it will be. And I've got so cups here. here. Wait. For us to try it. Okay, now hold on, before, you, before you've tried that, wait. Now, you don't have to wait for the whole thing here. I can, you can take this away. And it will stop. Okay. And it will go back when you put it there. But let me, you know, in the essence of saving time. Oh, okay. Here we go. Okay. Now, let me give Oops. me the cup. Pouring a little bit in here. Now, before you try the good stuff, this is tap water. Oh. Try that. Okay. I just want to see if you can tell a right. big difference. Pour a little bit of here for me. There you go. Thank you. And now we're going to enjoy some nice, uh, healthy lotus treated water. Wow. Wow. Even with your nose, you can tell a big difference. I can tell a totally tell a difference. Again. Don't drink from my side. <laughs> oh, yeah. Totally different. This is a very metallic-y kind of taste. Yeah. Can you taste that? Yeah, you can taste the minerals in the it. The chlorine and the stuff. minerals. <laughs> and uh, this just tastes like um, just tastes like water. It tastes very clear. It tastes like bottled water. So this is their secret. All this time, 39 cents an ounce. And it was. this is it. Yeah. What do you think? It's, it's good. It's, it's a little messy, you know, I mean. Well, I just didn't have that position quite right. That was my fault. Oh, well. It shouldn't, um, it shouldn't spit, out, spit out the other. Okay, you know, so... If you but push yeah, this button with your hand, it'll just, it'll just come out. Whoa! All over you! 
always put I the bottle totally, back. I could totally, if you didn't have that very expensive fun. mic on. If you oh. didn't have that very expensive <laughs> mic on, then yeah, I know. you'd be taking a shower I, right now. But it'd be a shower in beautifully pure, clean, fresh water. <laughs> It's not, it's, yeah, it's actually, it's not even, it's room temperature and it's yeah. not bad. I really like this guy. Um, I, you know, I think 149 for that <laughs> kind of thing is pretty reasonable. What do you think? I think if you're going to use it, absolutely. Yeah. You know. Uh, it does take a few minutes, but then it does come with this as well. I think as water treatment systems go, I mean, I think it's, it's nice. And if you're on a well water system, I think you're going to have a hard time going wrong. It's not, it, yeah, it's a big footprint. So, you know, it's one of those things you have to decide what do you want on your counter, your Cuisinart or your water purifier. That's true. It is but, big. Yeah, but yeah, I, uh, it does what it says it's going to do. I think so. I give it a four out of five. Uh, three out of five for me. Three out of five. I yeah. Too big. I just, too expensive. Too pricey. Uh, you don't like it. I think it's pricey. Yeah. I think seventy seventy bucks. Well, you like. I think you like the idea of drinking out of bottled water, though. Uh maybe. Maybe you know, if they could sell Lotus bottles. Hey, that I, you pour it into. I, I have to say, it is about perception, isn't it? It is. I mean, indeed. really. It's about perception, how you perceive things to be. Anyway, uh, it's a big, big footprint. Yeah. And I prefer just to do, uh, you know, reverse osmosis system. Right. For me personally. And it's under the sink and out of the way. And yeah. It, I it, to have it sitting on my counter all the time would be just a huge pain. Right. So I mean, for me personally, it wouldn't work. But you know, for someone else, it might. So that's three out of five for Tiff. Four out of five for me. Seven out of ten for the Tursano Lotus water treatment system. Mm -hmm. And that is uh, all the time we have for the show this week. So feel free to drop by our website www.neo-fight.tv uh, and uh, we hope to see you next week. Yeah, folks, thanks for joining us. Keep those emails coming. Again, if there's any products you'd like to see us review, please do. Drop us an email and let us know. And if you have an extra 30 seconds, take a look at this. In today's fast-paced world, it's vitally important that young people develop a good understanding of how computers operate and how the internet works. LittleGeeks.org takes donated computers refurbishes them, and then provides them to underprivileged kids at no charge. It's our goal at littlegeeks.org to make sure that no kids are left out of the digital revolution. To find out how you can help, please visit www.littlegeeks.org. Thanks a lot.